we are rushing out. First of all, rude. Welcome to a new vloggy vlog. <laughs> if this is your very first time here, my name is Maya. And in this weekly vlog, we are starting it out going to brunch. <laughs> Can't believe I was about to start the vlog without saying hello. What's up, y'all? Anyway, I'm officially tired of not wearing this Balenciaga shirt and waiting for somewhere to go. So we're wearing it today. This is the fit. <laughs> um, I have on this Balenciaga button down. It has Balenciaga on the back, um, which I might button it differently so that you can see the back better anyway i have on my wolford bodysuit underneath these jeans from fashion nova and then i have on these sock boots and i'm going to wear my uh Bottega bag as a clutch i wore my fendi bag to church this morning so i just need to switch everything over to this bag but um y'all know that in the last vlog the one i just posted like 30 minutes ago <laughs> um we went to Devin's for her fiance's birthday and now we're going to brunch for his birthday um Amira is going with us uh, another one of my friends gonna have her kids so I'm happy I won't be the only one but we're gonna have some fun and hang out and then Amira and I oh yeah I said I wanted this to be a clutch so I'm gonna put this inside the bag Amira and I are going to um go to the mall after that and then we want to go get some dinner so it's gonna be a full cute little day together um don't mind my nails y'all the nails still aren't done we're gonna go and handle that tomorrow but for that reason <laughs> i told you guys last week that i was buying some more um or i bought some more chanel earrings and i have them on today but i didn't want to unbox them with these crazy nails so we're about to insert some footage of me having my nails done and we're gonna unbox these earrings and then we're gonna be back <laughs> all right y'all so the nails are done so we can do this real quick <laughs> these are the earrings this is the box that it comes in um i did get these off fashion file this is not sponsored but fashion file um is where i purchased my chanel bag as well as my last chanel earrings and they sell new and used luxury products Usually you can like sell your, you know, luxury stuff that's lightly used to Fashion File and then they'll like resell it or you can sell new stuff maybe that you never worn or whatever. So these actually were brand new on Fashion File. They were, I'm going to say about $800, um, I want to say. This sticker comes on and it says that it came with the box and the pouch. So yeah, this is the Chanel box and you open it up. It has Chanel on the front and you just open it up and there are earrings the last ones i had they were um a gold and then they had the crystals placed inside the gold this one um is the silver one so that's the only real difference also these are a little bit more thicker than the other ones width wise like the other ones weren't as thick as these and um i don't know i really like these ones i really like these a lot these earrings always to me just give classy that's why i wanted to buy some more um and i did see one of you guys tell me in the comments of last week's vlog that i can look into getting the crystals replaced in the other ones i need to do that because i thought about that and i never actually looked up looked into it so let's do that because these are my favorite earrings and i'm gonna take way better care of these ones than i did the last ones guys but yeah here they are all right so yeah these are the earrings love them love them more than i like the other ones just because they're a little thicker um so love it the lipstick today is from revlon but i felt like this was going to be cute with a red lip but this is the whole vibe i went ahead and did the um y'all know how this shirt is made to where you can button it in the back to where it's like unique like that so i did that and i think it's really really cute i think this is a really cute vibe for brunch so you ready to go mama get your jacket girl and let's row because i'm a little bit late but it's okay i have on my watch i think that's pretty much the only thing i'm going to wear jewelry wise I also have on this diamond necklace from jamesallen.com i think it you looks look really really pretty yes thank yes. you sweetie oh, look uh, let's see let me make sure i got everything so that we'll be good being out all day um, I might take my flats just in case. But in fact, no, I'm gonna take these. Cause these are more comfortable to walk them all in. So I'm gonna take these Michael Kors um, boots with me no. to walk them all instead of these pencil ones because they're a little, a little not word. the most comfortable. A anyway, let's go. The sun is really out today. What's yeah. horrible? 
Like, yeah, the sun is really out, so like I can't sit the camera down there for, because you can't see anything. But I am happy that I um, I didn't I stopped waiting to wear this shirt because I feel like I'm always like wanting to wear it, but then you know I'm like oh, that's not good enough. That place not good enough for this shirt. <laughs> so since we have a full day today, I'm happy I wore it. Stop doing that because that's the case. I ain't never gonna wear none of my clothes. I like it. I think it looks really don't, cute. Don't get, don't get no makeup on it. Don't be trying to eat all in it. Don't be trying to I gotta eat food. in it. Don't be trying to dry food all on your new Balenciaga shirt that you haven't even wore because you thought that all the events that you've been going to isn't good enough for that shirt. <laughs> Thanks, Samira. Thanks for the prep talk. I won't get the shirt dirty. I promise. And isn't that we shirt like a thousand dollars? It was expensive. What? What is that supposed to mean, Mira? What does that mean? That's another reason why I feel like I needed somewhere special to wear it to. But at this point, I'm like, you know, I need to just wear it. So I'm going to be out today, you know, it just look cute. If I didn't wear it, I was going to sell it. But I really like it, so. Sell it? You get some money? Yeah, we're going to sell it. I bought it. No. I Girl, this, this shirt is too expensive to just give away. I save up all my money and you can sell it to me. That's going to take a while. Not as Did you even bring your, um... Your card with your money on it. You supposed to bring it so you can shop at the mall. Exactly. No, Amira thinks I'm, I'm made out of money. Don't you, Amira? No. You do. Cause you still want to shop, and you just figure, oh, mommy will pay for it. No, not mommy will pay for it. I have to pay it. Back. I'll pay mommy back. Yeah, but you also assume that I just have it to spend. You know what I'm saying? Amira doesn't like this conversation. Um. Isn't that then you pay me back? Anyway, y'all, I'll see y'all when we get there. This a whole thing. I thought it was gonna be a lot easier than this. You said what? I told you it was gonna take 20 minutes. It's gonna take 20 minutes. This is a cute spot over here. I don't think I've ever been in this one. Oh. Amira, I need you to take my picture. But we're gonna be late. We're not gonna be late. They don't, they still waiting. They still waiting. So, here, come on, let's take a picture. Yeah, I'm about to have Amira take my picture. So I'm gonna set y'all up so y'all can watch. No, it's not legal. This is, this is where I come all the time. Is legal. Here, I'm gonna set it over here. You can do lens buddy so that you can just, you know, take it. for being my photographer. No. <laughs> no. You said what? That's what we're not going to do. That's what who not going to do. Hi, y'all. Hey. What's up? What's up, beautiful? Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> we were there about, what was that, like about five minutes ago, mm -hmm. and they said nothing wrong. Oh, wow. She's pretty. Okay. Yeah, she's fucking pretty. We'll see. I hope my makeup looks okay in the sun. This lighting is horrible. I'm surprised. Okay, I'm going to be surprised too. Yeah, these are the new ones. You like them? What I liked about the other ones though is that they were gold with the crystals in it. These ones are silver. But they're so cute. We just left a brunch and Amira and I are on our way to, where are we going? To the mall. Yeah. Which and we're mall? about to do some shopping. I'm going to change my clothes, I mean my shoes, because these are not mall friendly. I don't know, whichever one you want to go to. Okay. I mean, West County is closer than the Galleria from over here. 
But, you know, we'll see. Either one is fine with me. Yeah. You playing around. <laughs> Come on, man. All right, y'all. We just got to the mall. Hold up, because I need to pull my life together. Come on, man. Just give me a second. Come on. I just needed a second to pull myself together, girl. It's a lot happening. I changed my shoes, too, because those sock boots, they're a little uncomfortable to be walking around the mall in. You uncomfortable to be walking around the mall. Come on, take it back to the car. What is happening? <laughs> All right, what's the agenda? Sephora. Sephora is number one, right? Yes. Now look at her. I'm gonna think she owned the place. <laughs> After Sephora, you wanna shop a little bit? Yeah, sure. Okay. What was that noise? Okay, anyway. I don't know. Where's your mask? You're out of control. Where's your mask? I have all my masks. Go, toys, games. <laughs> it's exciting. Go, toys, games. That's a, that's what I just posted today. Hi. Um, I am looking for. Um, thank you, thank you so much. Um, I'm looking for Vanilla Woods. Okay. And then I'm also looking for a butter drop from Fenty Skin. Do you guys have vanilla woods in stock? I have a little travel one. You don't have the big one? <laughs> no, we don't have the big one. Well, I was trying to get the travel one and the big one, so I'll take this. Yep, that looks like it. Okay, perfect. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Nope, I'm just looking for now. This is my main things. Thank you. That girl. They don't have. That girl on my photo. You had that foundation. That angle was not it. It was not good. <laughs> the angle was not given, though. <laughs> the angle was, Amir said the angle was not given. You hear me? I feel like this is the only thing that I need. So you want to get in line? Yes. Because I feel like I'm going to end up buying something yes. I don't need if I start walking around. Yes. It's hard to have my mask on with lipstick because I don't want it to get on the mask and then it get on my skin. Maybe they ain't going to give her a coat. Here you go. Have a good day. Thank, Thank you. you. So y'all, me and Amir are in um Mira and I are in Barnes and Noble and we are reading books. This is fun, something we never done before. <laughs> so we're just kind of killing time because we just got done eating and we want to go to dinner but we're full so yeah so we're about to read some stuff and just kill some time and sit here and chill and read which is fun because we've never done this before <laughs> it was Amir's idea so yeah we joined So we are now about to go and eat at um, Rosalita's and get us some Mexican food. We'll probably sit for a while because your girl, we ain't super hungry yet, but hungry. we definitely want to still, you know, enjoy the ambiance and being out here. Ain't nobody leaving and coming back. So <laughs> there's that. Why are you walking so slow, man? Because I am filming. Well, they have a heated patio. You want to go sit on the patio? You think it's going to be cold? No. I wanted to get a booth for two. Is there a wait? Okay. He almost dropped his tablet. <laughs> Thank you so much. Absolutely. Touch. 
my loves? Happy Monday. Um, we are about to go out and get our nails done. I just got some stuff I need to do because the weather is supposed to get bad this week. I was going to put it off till tomorrow because I'm just in a really weird mood today. I just didn't feel like doing much of anything. It was just, I don't know. I just feel really weird today. So I'm just off. Um, but we need to get it done because it's supposed to be th thunderstorming tomorrow. And then it's supposed to be snowing on Wednesday and Thursday. So <laughs> I'm like, let me go ahead and get up and go get my nails done. Amir, do you have your shoes on? Yeah, so I need to go ahead and get out and get the things done I need to get done. Um, I want to, I need to get some groceries and some toiletries, all types of stuff, y'all, we need to get today. I'm about to head out and get that done. I'm trying to pull my mood together because I'm just, like I said, I'm just not feeling it. But, you know, gotta, gotta keep pushing, gotta keep going. I feel like I look like a naked mole rat right now. Even though I got this hat on, I feel like because I haven't defined my brows at all, <laughs> that I look kind of weird. Where's my lip bar pencil? Oh, don't see it. So I'm just going to use my, what's this, brow definer from ABH just to like define them a little bit because I was feeling really naked. See, just a little something, something. All I need. So I'm deciding if I'm even about to get my um, toes done. I think I might just get my nails done. I actually took out the time to do my own, like take my nails off because um, they were really on there, really, really hard. And I get scared, you know, when I go to the nail shop and have them take my nails off because sometimes, you know, I get people that's not as experienced. Like they dig into my nail bed, I start bleeding, all that type of stuff. It doesn't happen a lot, but it has scared me enough. And I got my Invisalign in while I'm talking weird. But it has scared me enough to where I don't like them doing it. So I went ahead and popped them off. And I'm really thinking about getting something a lot shorter because... I just feel like I need a second, I need a break from the longer nails. So we gonna see. Hi. Hi how are you? Good, how are you? Um, I want to get a pedicure on a full set. bit later on in the day and it has been a day it has been a day sis it's been a day i've had some moments i've had to rip off my lashes and put on some new ones it's just been <laughs> from crying <laughs> but it's okay it's been a day but we are about to go ahead and um eat some dinner amira Mirrors around here. We're gonna go ahead and make us some dinner, and that will be the end of the night, child. Because I'm hungry and I just need to woosa woosa. <laughs> All right, y'all. So, y'all know what time it is. We're about to make us some dinner. Thank you so much to HelloFresh for sponsoring today's vloggy vlog. And uh, we finna decide what we about to eat because I am hungry, and like I said, it's been a day. <laughs> if you are unaware of what HelloFresh is, HelloFresh is a meal kit delivery service. So pretty much when you choose HelloFresh, you will get fresh pre-portioned meals straight to your door. And if you somebody like me, who isn't really big on cooking, even though I'm way better now since I started using HelloFresh. <laughs> <laughs> but if you're not really big on cooking and you know knowing what ingredients to buy and all of that jazz HelloFresh does all the work for you you just open it up and everything is in the bag that you need okay and it comes with directions too so you can't lose there so I know Valentine's Day has already passed however February is the month of love child so if you and your man or your people your kids <laughs> want to just have a night in I feel like HelloFresh is perfect because it's an activity you actually can do together y'all know that I'm always well not always but I am on a healthier food kick <laughs> so it allows me to choose meals and have control over you know my choices of what I put into my body and helps me to just have a home cooked meal on the table you know i'm not gonna say air night but <laughs> way more often than if i was not using it but they also have fit and wholesome recipes where it's lower in calories or lower in carbs so that way you can stay on track 
Um, I'm deciding which one we're going to make tonight. We have three options and honestly, I feel like I want to do the creamy, creamy lemon spinach ricotta ravioli. Whenever I get ricotta ravioli from HelloFresh, it be lit. So I think that is what we're gonna make tonight. So when you do have HelloFresh, you choose different recipes every week so that you can break out of just like the rut of making the same thing over and over, especially when you're trying to be healthy. It's like chicken and broccoli, chicken and broccoli, chicken and broccoli. And that's just, you know, I'm trying to get a little variety in my life. So <laughs> I do love that you can pick different recipes. And then HelloFresh also, like you guys know, has the fit and wholesome recipes, pescatarian, veggie recipes, just a lot of different options that fits you and your lifestyle. They also have quick and easy recipes as well. So we talking like 20 minute meals and things that's super, super easy to clean up and low prep. Also, what I love about HelloFresh is that I waste less food. Um, it's just me and my baby, so when I'm trying to, you know, have a meal on the table, I don't have to make too much, it's not too little, you know, it's perfect for that night for me and her. Or sometimes you could do either two portions or four portions, that way we can have leftovers and, you know, finish eating it up the next day. Y'all know I have to hook y'all up, so make sure you guys go to HelloFresh.com and use my code MAYAGALORE16 for up to 16 free meals and three surprise gifts. All right, you ready to try it? Oh. Uh, I didn't taste anything. You tried it already. It was just the edge. It was and just what? It was just like the edge of this, so I didn't really taste anything. Uh-huh. You tried to I try it. I did not. See, look. Let's try it together. Okay. You ready? Two. One. Mmm. I love that. Is it good? Mm-hmm. Very good. The noodles has like this ricotta cheese in it, which is like delicious <laughs> i left the vegetables out in the mirrors um dinner she didn't want the vegetables so i just made her the noodles with the um sauce and the parmesan cheese and delicious all right y'all so we're gonna go ahead and finish eating and then um more than likely i'm in a little bit of a mood so i will see you guys tomorrow <laughs> and I am up and edit because um, your girl had a rough night. Okay, I'm gonna put the products up so you guys can see what I'm using. This is my Too Faced Plump and Prime um, primer. But right now we are preparing to go to um, and this shade is for R64. And I'm actually gonna mix this a little bit with my NARS Macau um, in the uh, Light Reflecting Foundation. I've tried to mix these a couple of times and I really liked how it was looking, so. Yeah, we're about to go to lunch with Tara 
Um, I want to take a couple pictures too today. So that that those are the vibes. <laughs> But yeah, y'all, last night I had the, I was in the weird, just yesterday in, in general, as y'all know, I was just in the weirdest mood. Like I was just feeling very, um, I don't know. I don't know. I feel like it was just a mental health thing. It's so important to check in on your mental health, y'all, because yesterday I feel like when I have so many things on my plate, so many things on my mind, so many things going on. Um, sometimes I tend to just shut down and it like takes over me emotionally sometimes. And yesterday was one of those days. <laughs> like everything that I have going on just took over. And then sometimes, um, if I'm just gonna be honest, I start getting a little bit worse while I'm in that moment because I feel like I have, okay. So I am human, obviously. So I have things, you know, going on in my life and issues that I'm dealing with and things that make me sad or things that make me upset. But sometimes my success or like, you know, the great things that are going on in my life, sometimes it makes me feel like I don't have a right to be mad about some things. And for me, sometimes that makes me beat myself up when I'm feeling sad or frustrated or discouraged and things like that because it's like Maya sis what look at your life look at what the things you prayed for are here you know um you have a good life you know what I'm saying and then I start to beat myself up and feel like you know I don't have a right to be upset but I have to stop myself and you know I had a long conversation with my mom last night and she's like you know forget that mindset because that's crazy <laughs> just because you have things or you've accomplished certain goals or you know you have a certain life doesn't mean that problems don't arise doesn't mean that you're not supposed to be frustrated or go through things or be overwhelmed or discouraged at times so Shout out to my mommy for making me feel better on that one. Cause I mean, I knew that, but sometimes I just can't help for my mind to go there, you know? And I just used my soft matte, NARS soft matte and Amon, Amon, and then my Flawless Fusion, um, Laura Mercier. This is in 4N. And yeah, y'all, so my mom talked me through that. It made me feel better, even though it was information I already knew. It's just hard for me to pull myself out sometimes. I definitely should have let that sit down a little bit more, but. I don't need this to last too, too long. But yeah, y'all, I was I was just on and off crying yesterday. Um, I was crying. I was just kind of, partially I didn't feel like I knew how to explain it. And I kind of put it on stress and just like, just having a lot on my plate. And like I said, I'll be just breaking down and shutting down sometimes. You know how sometimes you have a lot to do or you're stressing about a lot of things and you need to like get things done or you know prioritize things but you have so much that you just shut down like that was me yesterday <laughs> and um it was it was just a lot and I feel like I also kind of tend to get wrapped up in things in my mind that don't necessarily what's the word what am I looking for to say where is my okay here we go this is my matchstick from Fenty Beauty and Espresso. Uh, I'm gonna go with my nose. And a little, little cheek action. I totally lost my train of thought. I forgot what I was just saying. <laughs> but anyway, um, I'll put it on the screen if I can remember what I was saying during editing. But yeah, y'all, uh, it was just it was just a rough evening for me. So later on last night, um, I ended up paying my niece to watch Amira. I dropped her off over at my sister's house. And then I um, went and picked up a couple of sushi rolls for my friends and I, and I drove over to Devin's and me, Devin and Sierra, um, cause they had been over there all day, but I, you know, just was having a day. Then I was at the nail shop forever. So when I told them I was about to go get sushi, they was like, just go get it and bring it over. So I did that. And we just hung out for a couple hours, watched sisters and laughed. And I was really happy I was able to do that just to get my mind off of, you know, everything in life and all of those things. So, uh-oh, I'm peeling. I wonder what's not mixing. I, I feel like, okay, maybe, let me just not do that. I feel like that primer and I've used that primer with this before, but this is my first time using the primer with the Makeup Forever. 
I don't, I'm not too sure that they like each other. So, it's okay, I'm gonna stop doing that and I should be fine. Yeah, but then I opened my devotional this morning, um, go on to the next level, and I'll leave the link for that in the description. I have um, told you guys about that devotional before. It actually was written by my sister. I've gone through that devotional, 30 day devotional multiple times. So now I just kind of ask God, you know, lead me to a page or something that I need to see, something that I need to know right now for this moment in my life. And I opened up to day nine, and it was all about, you know, trusting God and what he has put in you. Trust him to see you see it through. You know what I'm saying? Um, and, you know, going against discouragement and all of that. And I was like, that is exactly what I needed to hear today. And based on, you know, my experiences and how I was feeling yesterday. So um, that was a blessing to me this morning. And I was just grateful you know, the guy gave me that confirmation and that help in the moment when I needed it. So, yeah, y'all, this primer does not like this Makeup Forever foundation. It is not, they are not getting along right now. They are not getting along. I'm using my minted bronzer. I also need to get my niece over here to help me um, clean my brushes, y'all, because when I tell you, I have about eight different tins in there full of dirty brushes. It's not funny. Cause I just grab new brushes because I got so many. Child, once, 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 once some are dirty, I just go get some more. <laughs> and now they're all dirty. So, story of my life. It's fine. It's fine. We are pretty much done with this makeup. All I need to do is throw on some blush, mascara, and highlighter. And we're gonna head out. Oh yeah, y'all. We are going to Atlanta next week. So next week's vlog. Half of it will be filmed in the AT. We will be in Atlanta because we are shopping for homes next week. We're starting the this, this shop. <laughs> so yeah, I'm super duper excited to go to Atlanta and I'll be there for almost a week. So I am looking forward to that. I'm really looking forward to it. And I'm trying to like plan content too. So I said that because I'm looking at this pink skirt that I got hanging up right here because I want to wear it for some content down there. So I'm actually thinking about changing the hotel that I already booked because I want to get content, you know? Um, but then I'm also struggling between like, I don't know how many times I'm gonna have to be going back and down, back and forth to Atlanta. So I also kind of want to be cost effective. But then I also want to ball out for the aesthetics of the content. <laughs> so that is my inter in ex internal struggle right now. But I'm gonna figure it out. I'm gonna figure it out. We'll figure out what we're gonna do, child. We're gonna see. Well, hopefully, maybe I find an option that's kind of in the middle, cost effective, as well as like aesthetically pleasing so that I can get the content that I want to get. Because, of course, you know, I'm gonna be going and getting content other places, but you know, when I'm in my hotel, I would love to be able to have some opportunities for content as well. So, I am like peeling, y'all. I am peeling. That is not good. Let me spray my Urban Decay. And the highlighter I used was um, my face palette, Minute Finish Face Palette from the Lip Bar. And yeah, y'all, these are the vibes. I'm about to figure out what I'm gonna wear. And then we're gonna do an outfit check and head out. All right, y'all, we got it fit. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. All right, what do we think? about this fit sis I really like it okay this is in all right so what do we think about this outfit I'm really loving it um you guys have already seen this white blazer which is from Express um I'm wearing it with this little um crop top these pants which are from H&M shoes are from Miss Lola bag is Prada and I think this is really really cute for pictures you know one thing I'm not crazy about though, about this blazer, is the way that my arms are made. You see how it kind of like goes into the crease right there on my arm? Like, I'm not crazy about that. So more than likely, I'm gonna wear this over my shoulders. <laughs> but you know, for the photos, you know, I feel like I can finesse it to look how I want it to. 
like I think this is really cute and these pants are large um but they're super loose so I could have done a medium but all they had was a small and a large and the small baby I could barely pull up over my my thighs okay so that wasn't gonna work <laughs> and I actually pulled my bun up like this to take a shower but now I just feel like it's giving a little it's giving a little something, something. you know what I'm saying I'm not I'm not mad at it <laughs> I am not mad at it. Y'all see, that's what I'm talking about. Like, uh, I don't like that. I'd much rather just wear it over my shoulders, but this blazer is amazing. I'm gonna go ahead and wear my YSL Libre today. And we're gonna go with these vibes. Really love that one for today. It's giving the vibes. I think I'm gonna go ahead and throw on my Chanel earrings. Let me grab them. I've been taking better care of these guys so you know it's fine everyone calm down <laughs> right now i have on these james allen um studs i can't wait until i have like a designated space like in my new closet for like all of my well, i'm claiming jesus that i have that <laughs> in my new closet for all of my jewelry so yeah and uh, let me show you guys oh, oh my god what happened to the top? Maya, get your life. Get your life, sis. Get your life. All right, let me show y'all with the um with the bag or with the jacket over the shoulders instead of on. So yeah, this is it over the shoulders. I really like it. I think it's really cute. And it's pretty nice outside. It's like 60 degrees. So I felt like this would this would work. I Let me fix my hair real quick and we gon' go. So y'all just remember that I have makeup on this blazer. <laughs> so I might end up wearing my uh, leather one instead. Um, but for pictures, we still rocking with this white one because baby, we can remove makeup and editing. So that's not a, that's not a problem. <laughs> I also brought the outfit that I had on last week um, just in case because or not last week on Sunday because I feel like I want to get those pictures again Amir did a great job getting those pictures but y'all know I've been wanting to take pictures with my big camera so I just feel like I want to do that instead so we also have been in this um hallway before so it should be cute Okay, girl. Bye. All right, y'all. So that was a success. I hope. <laughs> Sometimes I can't tell completely if I'm focusing right in, on my camera. So I'm just hoping and praying that I did it the way I needed to do it. Why does it look out so blue out here? I do know. Let me go ahead and throw my camera in my trunk. So I'm not sure if I'm gonna have time or not to um, actually do the other content that I want to do the redo of the content because I just felt like them other pictures were not as not good enough so and I guess I can keep this blazer on I'm just so self-conscious of the arm situation on it I don't really like how that looks and then there's makeup on it but if it looks but if you're not like all up in my face you can't really tell and Maya loves to wear white and cream clothing so you know that's that's great, you know. We love that for me. Anyway, um, see now it don't look so. Mm, never mind. Yes, it does. Cause I feel like you know I I have bigger arms. I feel like this blazer is meant for a smaller armed person, or these need to be like more out. 
I don't know, y'all. Probably just being picky, if I'm being honest. So, don't mind me, sis. Do not mind me. Let me don't take this. Is it gonna stay? Let's see. I'll say, let me just go ahead and take this camera down for it forward. The reason why I won't stay is because I have a. Uh, why did I pull out this way? I should have went the other way. Let's drive back in and then pull back out the opposite way. That quick, lost my train of thought. Forgot what I was about to say. So there's that, Maya. I can't be thinking about all these things at one time, sis. Can't be doing that. You gotta be quicker than that. You gotta be quicker than that. Okay, yeah, that was definitely about to fall. Let's see if I can find somewhere close to or should be over here. Yeah, I might go ahead and put on my Zara blazer because I'm more comfortable in that one. Um, sir, what? Oh, Maya, be patient, okay? I have patience. I have patience indeed. Are these free spots? Because I will park right here. Say I won't. No, that's a little far. Anything closer? Oh, yeah. A little bit, not really. Do y'all better kick at me talking, talking to myself? Cause child, I'll be having a whole conversation with Maya. You hear me? There's Tara. I'm gonna park right next to her. <laughs> I found her. Yeah, I think I'm about to put on my other blazer. I just feel like this one looks stupid. I feel like it looks dumb. Look at Tara. She over there taking pictures of herself. Look okay. at. I think she cute. Cause she is cute. <laughs> Hilarious. Okay, y'all. Oh, zoomed in. All right, y'all. Let's go. That's different. Thank you. Well, I actually um. Great. You just put it up. Yeah, I put it up to take a shower, and then I was like, this is cute. The pictures ended up being cute. Well, they're on my memory card, oh, so I okay. can't even look at them yet. I gotta. With that, you took them with that? Huh? Have you been taking pictures with that camera? This? No. Okay. I, I bring my big camera when I take pictures now. I don't know if it's the river, but it is like exceptionally more cold. Is that more, more cold than, than it was? It's way more cold than it was. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Amira said this morning that the weather is having mood swings. There he is. <laughs> For two. What you want? I don't care what you prefer. Um, more light? Better? Wanna go back there? Is it light back here? Yeah. It's lighter. Yeah, can we go over here? Do you want a booth along the window? Yeah, a booth along the window. Yeah. So we should be for you. The ladies enjoy. Thank you. Oh, no, no, no. It's, look, it's the stand. It's broken. How did that prevent I don't know, because look, I don't know how to, I don't know how to tighten it. stupid so it's like I'll just hide it a little bit they are definitely very hanging low so I no hang time. you don't want no hang time you just want your titty to be bigger you don't want them to hang Tara <laughs> <laughs> I'll take whatever come hey. girl look my titties they be trying to point to the flow you hear me they don't know not yet Lord I feel like that'll, that will only happen if I have another baby, which is undecided. You was just open. <laughs> is that on? Yes. <laughs> yes, it's on. Okay. Let me be quiet. I feel like. It's like, so what she said is. <laughs> <laughs> you meet somebody who's in line with the things that you want in life, mm -hmm. and it's not as much of a question to have any more children. 
And I feel like that, like you said, I feel like that would be a good situation for me because I feel like if everything is aligned, I feel like God has put us together. You know what I'm saying? He's gonna be an active father and I'm in love. You know what I'm saying? And I feel like I've never so felt that way before. Oh, wait, how many, how many you want? Where you want me to start it? Where do you want me to start it? You, like <laughs> you want it like this? Or you want it like You want that? the leg up like that? <laughs> For real. What you want? You know, and I've never felt that way. And while I feel like, you know, if I don't, I don't know, I don't see myself settling for somebody who I don't feel like it's worth that. But I feel like unless I have that, I, I'm not gonna be willing to have any other children because other things are going to override that. Mm -hmm. But if I have that connection with somebody and also feel like God is telling to me to do it, I I'll be open that. to have babies. I just wanted to point out that I know this step. And I wasn't gonna say nothing. But I was happy for that moment because I was like, so she wasn't even worried about it. I wasn't. Oh, but it's like, it's gotta be the right person. For me, it's just gotta be the right, it's gotta be the right person. If I have those feels and it's a line and I feel like God wants this and he's telling me that this is what it's gonna be and we gonna procreate and then that's what we gonna do. We'll see what God has for me. Maybe God has a nice gentleman for me who's older, who already has children or doesn't want any. And then, you know. You never know. But, you know, I'm open to the other as well. <laughs> you never know. The right situation sometimes, we don't know what we're going to do today. Mm-hmm. Girl, please, I'm in love with my man like that. <laughs> oh, baby. <laughs> How many kids you, you like? want? What you like? Whatever you like. <laughs> Whatever you like. Whatever you like. <laughs> Whatever you like. <laughs> <laughs> How many babies you want? Whatever you want. Exactly. How many you want? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Girl, look, I will be willing. Lord, I see what you do for others. Lord, I see what you do for others. <laughs> Give me a little some slip of that. I see what you do for others. I still have faith. I definitely have faith for sure. I just, you know. I just be trying to listen to God and listen to what he's trying to tell me because I don't want to end up with the wrong person. Okay. Parts of my life is over with. Yeah. This time. Yeah. Discernment is big for me. And I feel like I'm pretty I have a I have a good discernment when it comes to men.